Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do a reading for Taurus for the week of February 8th through the 14th. Okay, so this is for Taurus, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. And the timing is still fluid, but we're just going to see what comes up, preferably for that week. Um, I do apologize for the vehicles in the background. I am going to get sound blankets, but I haven't gotten them yet. So what do we have? What do we have for Taurus for February 8th through the 14th? Taurus, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus, please. Younger man. Younger man. Dealings or relationship with a younger man. So you're going to be dealing with a younger man this week. Looks like a woman to me. I don't know. Anyhow, could be a man or a woman. Let's get another one. It says man. Oh, of course. And we have one that flipped too. Wedge. Someone is trying to come between you and a friend or someone you want. It's this younger man. This younger, or I don't know, but it feels like it is. It, trying to come between you and someone or something that you want. This one that fell on the floor. If I can get it. Somebody is coming between you, or trying to anyway. Someone is trying to. Trying is better than doing it. Money path. A path with money is waiting for you to find it. So that's good. So anyway, we got, we got a, looks like we got a problem here. So dealings or relationship with a younger man. Someone is trying to come between you and a friend or something you want. It appears that it's this person. It does. Let's get one of these. I don't know what it's called, I'm sorry. The, the boxes are somewhere. And I wouldn't know anyway. Anyhow, what do we have for Taurus? Oh, there it is. We got a pile, but we're only going to take the one on the bottom. Ten of Gabriel. Ask your angels for helpful people to lighten your load. Working too many hours. Trying too hard to please others. So you're trying too hard to please others. Ask your angels for helpful people to lighten your load. Working too many hours, trying too hard to please others. You need to just take a step back by the looks of things and be careful with who you're dealing with because you got somebody that is against you. All right, let's see what else we got. Obviously, you're trying to build that money path. So what do we got? What do we have for Taurus, February 8th through the 14th? Ooh, facing some life challenges. Don't, you've come so far now, growing weary. You may be growing weary, you know, you may be on the edge of giving up. You may be feeling a little or a lot overwhelmed. Um, I feel like you need to be strong. You need to be strong. Remember how far you've come. Okay, you've come a long ways. You may be feeling a little weary right now. You may be feeling like, what's next? What's next? You know, what am I going to have to deal with next? So, you know, and I feel like you've got a lot on your plate. I do feel like you have a lot on your plate and you may be feeling like you need to protect yourself. You may be on the defensive. Maybe that you're going to be on the defensive this week, you know, because maybe you need to be by the looks of things. You, you know, you may be dealing with somebody who is really putting you on the defensive. They are causing you these challenges. You don't know what's coming. You know, that's like, if you take a look at this guy's face, he's like, what is coming next? It's like, I just, I can't even imagine what's up next with this person. So, you know, looks like we, we're in that state of mind.
death, death reverse, holding on is holding, this holding on is getting old, disaster. Um, somebody is unwilling to let go, they're unwilling to release. This is somebody that is probably draining, it's probably very exhausting. I feel like you're exhausted. Um, oh my goodness gracious, death refusing to, to move on. Somebody may be refusing and they're holding on. Uh, and it's getting old, it's over. It's already, it feels like it's already over, but uh, hmm. fighting to the bitter end. Somebody is like fighting to the bitter end. Knight of Pentacles, now golden opportunity. You, you, I feel like you're gonna be given an opportunity. You are. I feel like you, because I feel like this is you, I feel like you're gonna be given an opportunity. And it's because of your hard work. Okay, you're a hard worker. You've, you've built up a foundation or you're building a foundation. This is being in, be in uh, we have a hard worker here. Somebody that is very strong that you, I feel like you've already been through a lot. You have some sort of experiences, uh, life experience anyway. Um, Knight of Pentacles is a golden opportunity Somebody's going to be given an opportunity that leads them towards more stability, financial stability. Somebody's, somebody's trying to come in between it, though, by the looks of things. Ooh, this yeah, unbelievable. As we get sirens... The sun and the moon, the sun and the moon. So this is light, this is a shadow. So light is gonna be shed on something. May have something to do with the child, innocence here. There's fear, there's illusion, there's addictions, there's uh, deception, all is not as it seems. But some sort of light is gonna be shed on a situation because happiness and growth is where it's at. It's all about stability and security and growth and happiness. But there's some sort of darkness that is looming. There's darkness that is looming. There's, there's, a, there's an unclear and difficult back path ahead. And this could just be your fear. Fear. There could be fear. There's some sort of addictions here or, or fear. Or fear of the unknown. Could be fear of the unknown. Um, but there's also something that is being hidden, okay? So this is something that is being hidden, but it can't be hidden, it's clear. So something is hidden, but it's going to become made very, very clear. We have something to do with a sunny place, a warm place. This is feelings, so somebody may, I don't know if somebody's been hiding their feelings about something, um, their emotions. I do feel like uh, there is some, I feel like we have somebody here that's up against a brick wall as well. They're up against a brick wall. Um, I feel like there's a, there's happiness to be had. There's a, there's a new beginning here. There's a happy new beginning here. And there's an opportunity, a golden opportunity to go after that happiness or something or to have it. To have that happiness and that stability and security. So there's a golden opportunity to have that. But this is fear. This is this is fear. This is unknown. Fear of the unknown. Um, unforeseen forces. There's, there's hidden forces here of some sort. There's some sort of hidden forces. There's some sort of fear. There's illusion. And there's darkness. Somebody's been in a state of darkness, but... And there's some sort of addictions that have been hiding something. All is not as it seems. Don't give up. You're going to get an opportunity and I feel like this, this is, it's getting old. You've been waiting for it. And you're, and you're feeling like, oh my God, what's next? What's next? You know, what, what's going to happen next? I see worry here. I feel like there's something you don't know. There's something that is hidden that is going to be revealed to you. Something is going to be revealed to you. 
And I feel like you're going to get an opportunity that you that you've worked for, that you've waited for, or something like that. Could be a gift, could be a job, could be money, could be uh, whatever it is. It's a stable opportunity. It's something you're going to get something that you are fearful that you're not going to get by the looks of things. Or you may be on guard. You know, you're like, oh yeah, I see that you are on guard. You're probably in disbelief or something like that or, or whatever. Anyhow, you're going to be getting a new opportunity and it is below the surface right now. Okay, right now, but it's about to pop up. Okay, you're going to get an opportunity of some sort. Um, you deserve it because of that Knight of Pentacles. This is somebody that is very, very hardworking, that is loyal, that is faithful, that is um, real, okay? Uh, and there's an opportunity for happiness, a lot of happiness. Um, there, somebody's been hiding their feelings about their own happiness as well. One more card. That's it. That's all we need. Ah, the High Priestess reversed. Could be dealing with initials J and B or B and J. Just saying. Um, anyhow, the High Priestess is a secret that is about to be revealed. Somebody has definitely been hiding something and it is going to come out this week. Good luck. Let's just get one of these for the uh, thumbnail. That's a good one because that's where it ends, right? With happiness, extreme happiness. So you're gonna, you are gonna get what you want. You are, and it's gonna make you happy. But there's definitely some fear. There's fear. And it could be. Some of you may be. Now I'm going further. Oh, God. So some of you may be becoming single. You may be becoming single because this is taking soul ownership. And the high priestess is very self-sufficient chooses to be alone. Some of you may be choosing not to be single. But anyhow, this is a this is a new beginning. It's a new day. It's a yes answer. Yes, you deserve it. Whatever it is. It's it's comes it's very uh somebody's been hiding something. Hiding a secret. You may even have a secret admirer. Anyhow, we're done. Talk to you later. Good luck.